the IFAS, they did a great job in that mock test. They designed very well and the answers they provide up behind that and the explanation mm -hmm. with videos that was like very good. Hello everyone and welcome to IFAS. I am Swati from IFAS. I have Salesh with us who has secured 11th rank. Hello Salesh. Hello ma'am. How are you? I am good. How are you doing Salesh? I am doing great ma'am. Wonderful actually in fact to say. Yeah. So um, how is everything? Mm, it was quite like a dream and okay. I did good with that. So first of all my first question to you. How are you mm -hmm. feeling after getting success in IIT, JAM, BT? And that too, you know, not a simple success, a big, very big achievement, achievement actually, AR11. That is a dream for many people. So how are you feeling now? Actually, when I saw the rank, it was also a dream for me. And it yeah. was like a dream come true for moment for me. And I was really excited. I mean, I couldn't express the happiness I was having in my in words. I was like trying to call everyone and say my family, my friends, everyone yeah, that I have scored I, this I much good here. And yes, of course, IFAS played a very important role in this. In my like journey. everyone will be delighted by your success, no? Mm -hmm, yeah. Because ये कोई छोटी बात नहीं, बहुत बड़ी बात है जो achievement आपने हासिल की है, वो कई लोगों का सपना होता है. So as you said कि आपने expect नहीं किया था, you haven't expected this much, uh, right? Yes, yes. I expected about I will be coming around top 50, but okay. not this 11. Because uh, once I came out of my exam. I just know, I mean, I would do this much, I would get this much marks and with that, I calculate mm -hmm. my rank will be around below 50. But yeah. 11 was totally yeah, unexpected. Exactly. So first of all, from the whole team of IFS, we wish you very, very best wishes. We give you very best wishes for the future also and congratulations for this success. From the thank whole you, IFS. Thank you so much. Yeah. A very grand congratulations to you because you have like achieved and you have made everyone proud at IFS also to your family, friends, relatives, everyone. Yes, thank so, you so much. So next question will be like, uh, I want to ask you like how you came to know about this exam, IIT jam? Actually, uh, I did know quite a lot about this exam while I was doing my undergraduate. My seniors were speaking about this exam. Okay. So I did came know about this and I just checked their website and uh, I mm -hmm. just came to know about them and then I saw their previous year papers and how was it like, can I do it or should I need some help. So I came. That's how I came to know. Yes. Yeah, so the, just uh, I wanted to know a little more about you like when in the beginning when you were a child or when you were in school have you thought of something like this or it just came you know when you passed schools and while you are doing graduation or something mm -hmm. actually while i was in my 11th and 12th i did find that biotechnology was very interesting for me okay so i decided at that time itself i need to do in this field only so and then mm -hmm. i joined this bardasan university where i'm i was doing my uh, undergraduate yeah. And then there, um, I came to know about these various exams, gate, jam and all. So, and then I started, I mean, I should be pre preparing for these. I should have a focus on these along with my semester exams. So, I did okay. like that. So, like, are you interested in biotechnology from the beginning only? Or yes. uh, uh, did no, it interest you I, later on? I, I was interested from the beginning itself. Actually, when I was introduced to biotechnology, maybe at 12th, okay. biology. At that time itself, I started like liking okay, this. So that time you have like you known and fixed in your mind like this is the subject you will go for. Yes, yes, I will okay, make my career great. only in this subject. Yeah. <laughs> great, great. So okay, I I just and all our viewers also want to know who mm -hmm. was your motivation during this uh, entire preparation because you know sometimes it happens and we, where, while students are preparing for the exams, there are so many times they feel depressed. You no, know? yes. Maybe they gave a test series or something. They didn't score that good. So it makes them demotivated. So what was your constant source of motivation during this journey? Actually, I had a professor and his name was Shadab Nizam. Okay. And he, he was really motivating. He took classes. It was like really good. Uh, he makes us to understand everything. He, he, he mentors us. I mean, he gives talks to prep, yeah. prepare us. Like that. So he did a very good job on my school. I mean, teachers. They too had a very, I mean, influential role in me. So okay. they were like 
all influencing me and my uncle he is also in this biotechnology field okay, so okay. He, he also did inspire me a lot hmm so how was your journey at ifs during this preparation like uh, because our many students from ifs you know look up to you as an achiever and they also want to know ki how you achieve this success because you are an inspiration for them so i just want to ask this very very uh, you know important question to you like how you see your success in ifs because how was your journey in ifs i want to know actually i would say ifs has molded me and has prepared me to this success so i dedicate this success to ifas and the teachers and the who are working so behind them yeah. of course ifas and your hard work has, has uh, you know um, like made it through uh, through this all uh, journey of success and we are very very happy for you so my next question will be like um, after this after achieving this what are your plans actually i am planning to join integrated phd at iisc and iiscr okay so, Have I you like also uh, already thought of that, or this is something in your mind? Ah, uh, this was something in my mind uh, under during my post. I mean, undergraduate itself. So I was thinking like that, and I have also cleared this JG bills. So okay. I, I'm aiming aiming for this PIFR too. Yeah, Lovely. Mumbai Lovely. most probably. Okay, so because you have been a student also, so many mm-hmm. of our students will want to know what was your daily routine, like how you managed like studies and everything in your. you know daily routine how you accommodated that actually i don't have a specific schedule at all i study when i want to study when i feel like i should study now i study and i i mean i concentrate completely i don't distract okay. don't get myself distracted use for so not like time bounded or something whenever you feel uh, like studying no. you, you was like yes, giving time to yes i study. did study like that but uh, i mean at least i will give 3 hours per day i mean weekdays okay. weekdays 3 hours per day and in weekends i increase it up to 6 hours Okay, so I want to know, like, what was your strat- uh, strategy for the preparation of the exam? Like, how you prepared the study materials, or maybe the courses you have, uh, like, you know, given importance to the test series and everything. What was yes. in your uh, agenda and strategy? Uh, actually, my agenda was like uh, to give more mock tests. So, mock tests is the only thing that can prepare you for the final exam. Okay, yeah. And you it, have uh, like given full importance to mock tests because mock that test, was the yes. thing where you can, you know, evaluate yourself. Yes, evaluate myself. And IFAS, they did a great job in that mock test. They designed very well, and the answers they provide up behind that, and the explanation mm-hmm. with videos that was like very good. Okay, so how was the test series at IFS? How you like uh, felt that? Was it good for you? Yeah, it it really helped me a lot in the exam, and I could see some questions were just a modification of those questions. Okay, so they were the exact from IFS. Yes. Yeah, so I would thank the, I mean the professors or the teachers who designed those questions. I'm really grateful and thankful to them. And the doubts were your doubts were cleared during the test series. Mm, yes, also? yes. Doubt, and they had an exclusive doubt clearance session too. and my all my doubts could be posted there and we can contact them through whatsapp or anything it will be clear like instantly i i like that about ifas okay so one question away from this uh, you know you know this leak and everything i want to ask you is mm-hmm. like uh, are you on social media uh no i just deactivated my accounts <laughs> okay yeah. so that was uh, my question which was which is like coming now is mm-hmm. how you maintain because this is an era of modernization every yes. person is on social media like you know yeah. uh, in 2 minutes you will miss up some information if you are not uh, that much conscious about mm-hmm. it right yes yes so in this time of like social media and everything internet <laughs> basically we can say how you manage your studies with this thing Well, how you like? Uh, were you like active on that, or were you were like uh, away away from these platforms? I was like away. Actually, I was uh, during my first three years in uh, in my undergraduate. I was like active, and in the I mean this year. So yeah. this is my crucial year. So I deactivated every account, and I was very away from yeah, yeah, social yeah. media. Otherwise, I I was like using it all the time. Okay. And were you using like Telegram? In Telegram, there are some like groups also, na, no? for preparation and everything. Were you using that? Ah uh, yes, I did use Telegram. I mean, IFS has a Telegram group. Yeah, yeah, IFS also yeah, has a Telegram yeah. group. So I did use that. Yeah, that, okay. that comes under study study material, so it's not a social media. Okay, so my uh, my last question will be like, yes. what is the message you will want to give to all IFS, uh, you know, IT Jam aspirants who all uh, who will be like giving the exams for the very next time? Mm, what message uh, you want to give them? 
I would say make use of IAS mock test series. Very, I mean, it can help you prepare very mm. so much. To an, it, I mean, it takes you to it takes you to a next level. So I would say use it as, as precious as possible. And then the doubt clear clearance session, you have to you must use that. That's. Thank you so much, Alish, for uh, you know giving your time and having a great conversation with me. I was like glad I had a chance to talk to you. It was great having you with me on this platform. Thank you so much, and we wish you very, very best for your entire future and you know coming endeavors. Thank you so much. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you, Alish. <laughs>